first card we got out? Fears. Fears is not a fact. It's not the way you're fearing it. Whatever you're fearing, stop fearing it because it's not going to happen. It's just an emotional energy that you're picking up and maybe you've been triggered off from something in your past that's bringing on to the present. Fear right now is just something that you're working up inside yourself about your relationship, about your situation, whatever that is. Maybe you're fearing that this person will never come back or this person doesn't love you or this person is not who you truly think that they are or you're never going to meet anybody. Don't let the fear pull you down. Don't let the fear. That's what this card is telling you. It's telling you that there's a message of love. The next card. Messages of love represents new beginnings, new energy. So with fear, you have message of love. So this is telling you right now, don't fear it. Stop putting that pressure on yourself because it's not the way it is. If you're working up something in your mind, something that happened and yeah fear we have to we all have it I mean it's just a common thing um, but if you're constantly overthinking it over and over and over is this person who I think that they are is this person with someone else are they cheating on me um, do they love me I mean that's fear I mean if you have to doubt it and, and if you're if you're fearing it and you have to keep like playing it over and over in your head you need to have a conversation with that person to make things right this is not something that you can just do on your own because it's just it's going to create anxiety reunion this is a very good card we got a lot of good cards today reunion so something is going to bring it that you will find yourself you will find the love you will find something that will bring you the love that you need don't put too much on yourself don't regret it never regret every time you regret you're putting on more negativity on yourself. Regret sometimes can happen without trying to have ha having a, a regret. Maybe you don't regret, but thinking about the regret is actually a common thing. Um, maybe you didn't say something right, or maybe you didn't do something, or maybe you should have done more. Don't regret it. This is this is a reading that's telling us that you didn't do nothing wrong. Okay, you didn't do anything wrong. You have a lot of anger. And anger only makes more anger. With the fear, with the doubt, with the negativity, you need to start forgiving yourself. Forgiveness. When you forgive yourself, I'm not saying that everything is going to be, you know, picture perfect, but then you can feel more like, hey, I know what I did and I know what I need to do and maybe there's something that I need to start looking at. This is why it is so important and so crucial that you start focusing on you start making some me time you know now that we're coming you know in deeper into the new year you know we want to start I mean maybe you've made some plans at the beginning you know of the new year um, or still at the beginning of the year but you need to start producing that you need to start doing it you know get up and start making that happen um, there's a lot of energy that you're having that I feel it's a lot of anger fears it looks like a lot of emotional stuff going on um, a lot of energy that you need to just release Sometimes in order for you to find love, you need to release it and you need to open yourself. There's something that you're not balancing, something that you're not balancing in your life that's preventing you from doing the things that you need to do. Maybe that could be even with career. Maybe something in your career is feeling like it's, you know, like you, you need to, you know, focus more on it. You need to start looking at the things that have been passing you by, whatever that may be. You know what I'm talking about. I can't be the one to tell you. These these readings are messages coming from the divine that are given to me to give to you and take what resonates with you. It's not something that you can, you know, you know, uh, pretty much like precisely say, okay, this is what this is what Anne is telling me, and I need to do that. Yeah, I am telling you. I am bringing the messages out, but it's up to you to follow your intuition, what's in your heart. Um, that's what goes with any reading even a personalized reading you know everybody who is getting a reading out there from whoever that's what you need to do um, but it's time to forgive yourself you didn't do anything wrong we got we got two things that shows me okay it came up regrets forgiveness so if you regret something something you maybe broke up with someone and you said some harsh words you said some words that you didn't mean and now you're regretting it and it's time to forgive yourself if that person is meant to come back into your life they will come back into your life sometimes we get involved with different people and we 
break it off and whatever happens, you know, or they break it off. It wasn't all lost because it was a, it was a growth, you know, an area of growth in your life, a learning lesson. And then sometimes they come right back. I mean, I'm not here to tell you that person is not going to come back, but you need to learn from those things, those mistakes that you think you made. You know, the mistakes that you made were not mistakes. They were actually predestined for you to do these things. Okay. And they were also predestined to do what they did to you. Yeah. So it looks like, did I do something wrong or was it, they did something wrong? You know, you have to just, you know, narrow it down to see what you did um, and what you need to do because you did not do nothing wrong. That's what, the messages I keep getting. You did not do nothing wrong. Stop fearing it. The fear is just an emotion. Yeah, it's just an emotion. And there is a message of love. These cards are gorgeous. I love these cards. I'll put the name in the description area. Um, but yeah, you're definitely, you know, headed on the right direction. But you need to just follow what, what your intuition is saying, what your heart is saying, and not listen to what others are saying to you. Okay, so I hope that this reading resonated with you. There was a lot of important messages that I felt also. Um, and take what resonates with you and leave what doesn't. You know, sometimes it resonates with you more one week than the other or, you know, maybe two weeks later, you know, so save it, save it or, you know, sh maybe share this video with someone because maybe there's someone that you know that might, you know, benefit from this more than you realize, okay? Um, also, if you'd like to get your own personalized reading, now I do offer phone chat and email readings. Um, the links are down below in the description area. Um, I'm getting pretty good, so I'm pretty much like on target. So like I know there was a delay because I was like super busy like a few weeks back. So that's all settled. Um, and you know, it's pretty much like what it says on the website, how long, 24 to 48 hours. Um, usually the turn time, it depends. Sometimes I just get, you know, overwhelmed and, you know, I'll let you know, but I always do. So I just want to say to you guys, thank you all for the comments, the shares, the likes, and, you know, just reaching out to me. I love you all. And I plan to do these videos for many, many more years to come, Lord willing. Okay. Um, so I think that's about it. Okay. So until next time, God be with you all. Namaste.